Hello everyone. Welcome to Graphic Hunters. In this video, I will show you how to create an easy, editable neon text effect in Adobe Illustrator. Whether you're a beginner or a seasoned designer, this step-by-step -step tutorial will help you master the neon glow effect with just a few simple techniques. By the end of this video, you'll have the skills to add a vibrant, glowing touch to your text designs. So, let's get started. I have taken 1000 pixel to 1000 pixel artboard, you can take any of size that you want. Now go effect, select document raster effect setting. Take 200 around object. Then click on OK. Now take rectangular tool. and make a background equal to artboard. Change the background color black. Now place it perfectly on the artboard. Also lock the black background. For lock, go object. Select lock, select selection. Okay, that's good. Now go swatches, select a color which you want to use, I select this color, now go swatch option. Select global option. Then click on OK. Again select another color. Go swatch option, and select global and click on OK. Now select the two color by hold control and make a group and give it name Neon. Now go Gradient. Double click the black color. Go swatches, and select this color. Again double click white color, and select this one. Ok, that's good. Again go swatches. Click on new swatch. And give it name neon. As you can see. Here is add a gradient color which we use as a neon to our text. Now take text tool, and write a word, in which you want to add neon color. I write homes. Change the color to white, so that we can see the word. Change the font which you like. If you want. You can also use this font. But I want use another font, which name is Selfie Font. Now select the word. And make it middle align center. Again select the homes and go Pathfinder. Click on three lines, and select Make Compound Shape. Now go Swatches, and select the gradient. Again select the Homes, go Appearance. Select the Fill Panel. Go FX. And the select blur, and select Gaussian blur. Now make the radius 3 pixel. Then click on OK. Again select fill panel, make it duplicate. And make the Gaussian blur double.
Again select the fill panel, and duplicate it. And make the Gaussian blur double to 6. Do the same work for total 7 time. OK, that's good. Now select the first fill color panel, then click on add new fill. Again select first fill color panel, and go FX. Select stylize, select inner glow. Change the mode to normal. Also make opacity 100%. Select Center. Now increase or decrease blur as your need. I think, Pixel 2 is perfect for me. Then click on OK. OK, that's good. I have easily make a editable neon text effect. Now if you want to write anything, you can easily write, and it will be added neon effect for your all text. Friends, I will share you a bonus tips for neon effect. Now if you want to change the neon color, how to do that? Don't worry, keep watching. First select the text. Go swatches, and select the color. And go swatch option. Change the color mode to HSB. Now you can easily change the color. Also change the second color as like previous method. So friend, this is how you can easily change the color easily. I go back my previous color, because I like this. This text is totally customizable, if you want to add any text, you can. Same way you can delete text easily. Now select the text, and make it middle align center. Now go effect, and select document raster effect setting, and make resolution 300p. Ok, that's good. Thanks for watching. If you found this tutorial helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Graphic Hunters for more design tips. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss a new video. Have any questions or ideas for future tutorials? Drop them in the comments below. See you in the next video.